Sidemen Charity Match. The Best YouTube Player. Hello guys, the best compilations here again. Welcome back to another banger video. Today I will take you through the best YouTube football players of 2022. Make sure you watch to the end for some bonus mentions. Spoiler alert, this list is judged mainly on the player's previous forms especially their performance in the previously concluded Sidemen Charity Match. Before we go ahead, smash the like button and comment who you feel is the best YouTube footballer. Here are the 20 best YouTube footballers selected specially for you. At number 20, Cal Freezy. The main reason why Cal is at the 20th position is that he does not really contribute into the match. He is used to creating cursed images. But to be honest Cal is a very good player, I think if he focuses on the match better he would be rated top. At number 19, I show speed. Considering the 17 years old I show speed has only partaken in one official match, he really showed great passion and desire for football or soccer. I show speed is an American player and just recently learned how to play football. I show speed plays the left wing and plays like his idol Cristiano Ronaldo with the iconic number 7 shirt. He is also very energetic, so if you give him time to develop his skill, he would be unbelievable in the coming years. So, yes, he deserves the 19th spot. At number 18, Will N. E. William Jonathan Lenny is an English YouTuber. He has partaken in numerous matches, including the Sidemen Charity match. He has not really been a legendary player, but he has been a great addition to the squad. Helping in the defense and clearing his lines, Will N. E. is not someone to get past easily. Recently Will N. E. scored a goal in the Sidemen charity match wearing a GoPro which was assisted by Chunks. More about Chunks in the video. At number 17, Zerka. Zerka, also known as Joshua, Josh, is regarded as the father of the Sidemen because he looks older than the squad. Looks are not deceiving as Josh tends to act old on the pitch, just kidding. Josh is also a good defender wearing an iconic number 4 for Sidemen FC. Josh is a defender that mostly does not give up on his opponent and this act irritates them. Josh has also had some few iconic moments in his football career, so he makes our list. At number 16, Vicstar123. Vicstar123 is a member of the Sidemen that always rises up to expectations. Generally outside official matches Vicstar rarely amazes, but he has that habit of amazing the whole crowd on the big stage. Vicstar scored a penalty in one of the Sidemen charity which no one expected him to score. That moment was a one in a million moment. But guess what, Vicstar scored a non-penalty goal in the recently concluded charity match. Vicstar never disappoints. So he deserves the spot. At number 15, Jamie. Jamie is a rapper who represents the Sidemen FC in the charity matches. Jamie is a strong and fit player who keeps off opposition defender. At number 14, Bazinga. After his transformation from being fat to fit, Bazinga has been a solid center back for Sidemen FC. After all, his gym paid off. At number 13, HP Harry Panero. HP with the sauce. Harry Panero is a solid center back. He is so strong at the back, the opposition don't score when he is on the pitch. At number 12, Nico. Nico Amelana is the YouTube ultimate goal poacher. Nico is not shy to score as he is a dangerous predator in the box. At number 11, Castro. Castro all the way from the west is a solid winger. He has good touches and fantastic shots. Castro is a threat to any defending team. At number 10, KSI. JJ Alatunji Olajide is part of the Sidemen. JJ plays as center defending midfielder where he uses his strength to stop opposition attacks. KSI is generally good when he is on good fitness level. At number 9, W2S. Roto Shaw. Harry Lewis is a member of the Sidemen. Representing the Sidemen FC with his number 77 shirt. Harry is a good defender CB. He clears the ball very good and defends his goal cleanly. At number 8, Noah Beck. 
TikTok sensation Noah Beck is a very strong player on the ball. Very difficult not to feel his influence on the pitch. You can ask Chris MD about that one. Noah is skillful and gives accurate passes on the pitch. Making our number 8th pick on this very accurate list. At number 7, Chunks. Chunks a fantastic player with good skills on the ball. Chunks transformed from being overweighted to an ideal footballer's body. He a player that dictates the tempo of the game. Very calm on the ball. At number 6, Philly. Young Philly, the Colombian footballer, is a great player. With super amazing performances in matches. Philly has lasted the test of time as he always perform above average in all of his matches. At number 5, Manny. Manny, a manager for under the radar FC UTR, he is a very good and talented player with a lot of experience. Manny has scored a lot of great goals and he performs very well in matches. He puts a lot of dedication to all of his matches and it really pays off. At number 4, Chris MD. Chris MD, a free kick specialist. Chris is obsessed in perfecting the art of free kick taking. He brags that he could probably be the best free kick taker if he was in the Premier League. Well, Chris MD is good with the control of the ball and with striking the ball, he mostly has unlucky moments playing official matches and tends to struggle a lot to score goals. Bonus mention, Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast has little to no experience in football, but seeing him play in the Sidemen charity match recently he really proved he could get better with training in the coming years. At number 3, Toby. Toby Brown. Toby is no doubt an extremely talented and strong footballer. The Nigerian English footballer is very fast on the ball and has a good control of the ball. Toby gives incredible passes and scores fantastic goal. Makes me wonder if he is inhuman after all. Toby also represent the Sidemen FC with an iconic shirt number 21, which is his favorite number. There we have it our third spot. At number 2, Theo Baker. Theo is an English YouTube footballer. He has partaken in numerous charity matches, including the Sidemen charity match. Theo Baker is one of the real OGs in YouTube football. He has numerous legendary moments. Theo Baker is a very talented footballer, although he's get injured pretty quick, but he showed his fitness worth after running a half Ironman race. And that's why viewers, Theo Baker is on the second spot. And finally the best YouTube footballer goes to. Drum roll please. Mini Minter. Simon also known as Mini Minter is popularly regarded as the best YouTube footballer. Simon back in the first Sidemen charity match in Southampton scored a hat-trick with a goal he scored from the halfway line which ended up being the talk of the game. Also in the recently concluded match, Simon scored another hat-trick which totaled his goals to 7, the highest in the game. Also he bagged a whooping 10 points rating in the match. If you feel Mini Minter does not deserve the number 1 spot then, let me know in the comment below. And that brings us to the end of today's video. Hope you enjoyed the video. Let's try to bag 1000 likes, then maybe I will release a part 2. Who do you think is meant to be in the list? Comment down below. Do yourself a favor. Subscribe for eternal good luck. Peace out.